Willie, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. Glad to be here. Umekua vipi? Nimekua salama. Uh -huh. Yes. You know you always come up with like these topics. Emma, we throw them your way. <laughs> Somehow, it's usually like an interesting conversation to uh -huh. have. And today, we're talking about our exes. Yes. A conversation that probably mm -hmm. <laughs> is very sensitive. And uh, I, I want to start by saying <laughs> that, uh, um, you know, at times we paint our exes as devils and very oh. bad people. Well. But we need to understand that once yes. they were very important people into our lives. They were angels. Yes. There was a time that girl was an angel. There was a time you could not sleep. Yes. <laughs> there was a time you could not eat. Yes. Because of that girl. Yes. There was a time you could walk from Kayole to Tao. They would save 50 people. Yes. Now, all of a sudden, uh -uh. she has turned to be a devil. What was I seeing in him? <laughs> oh my god that is so true though yes for them to be an ex in your life mm -hmm. they must have meant something yes to you. they must have been a part of your life yes. you must have at some point loved them mm -hmm. become sort of like one with them yes. in a way mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. now they are not longer that yes and that does not make them to be devils okay that does not make them to be bad people because at times, you'll find that uh, this guy will say this girl is a devil. Mm -hmm. But on the other side, the girl is saying, this dude is a devil. So but, which is to which? But it depends, really. Now you see, this is it. What? We need to realize that what happened, maybe we reach to a, to a point and we realize this can't work. Mm -hmm. And one of the things that will make things not to work, mm -hmm. it is our personalities. Mm -hmm. Maybe my personality, I'm an outgoing person. Mm -hmm. This another person is not an outgoing person. Mm -hmm. And so you find every time we are having some quarrels. Okay. And I reach to a point I feel like, I think if this continues, to tenderea kuhatiana. And because I don't want to hurt her, mm -hmm. I don't want her to hurt me, mm -hmm. let's part ways. Okay. And I want to say this. I know even as we are having this discussion, Kuna watu wanaachana sahi. <laughs> kuna watu waliachana jana. Kuna watu waliachana jana. Mm. Na kuna watu wataachana kesho. Hata after hii conversation. <laughs> yes. But the, something else to also note. Apo kwa venye watu wanabadilika, badilika wili. Mm -hmm. Kuna watu wana kuingiza box na uongo. Mm -hmm. they, they say that they are this person. They mm. show you this person. Mm -hmm. The moment you've Maingia, kubalid. Ah, unapata si hivo. Si o hivo. That's when unapata mambo kwa ground. Different. Ni different. <laughs> And, and, and this is where we say that uh, we need, even as we are falling in love, it is okay to fall in love with our minds. Okay. Don't just fall in love with your heart only, but also in your mind. If this dude, anakwambianga, I, I know of this guy, alikuwa anafanya, alikuwa soja hapa Kenya Railways, uh -huh. but alikuwa anambia dem, anaingiza box, hey, ni engineer. Ah, ah. Yes. Yeni engineer wa trains. Yes. <laughs> but yeye ni soldier. <laughs> and so there are some things unafaa pia kukua unajiuliza. Aya ni engineer, okay. Engineer munafanyanga nini? <laughs> so sio tu kuambiwa unaitikia. Una, una uh -uh. mm -hmm. This guy, ako na marafiki. Can you talk to them? By the way, how is this guy doing? Uh, by, anafanyanga nini? Okay. You see? Yes. Now, you want to stalk your ex when it is done. But before you entered, you are not stalking him. See, now I want to see how he's doing or not doing. Maybe I'm, I, I want to see if I... I... Can we change it? We okay. start stalking before we enter. That's a good point, really. So, not stalking after, mm. but before. Mm. At least as I am entering into this relationship, mm -hmm. I have an idea who this guy is. Yes. So, you will not come and tell me what you are not. Because I am stalking you. Na kuangalia. Kuna mahali naangalia. Nina kufollow. IG. Niko pale. And I want to see. <laughs> yes. And you see, uh, again sometimes, uh, the, the, the life you portray in social media, sometimes it is a lie. Yes. You'll find someone taking a photo, ameenda mahali kwa hotel mzuri, anaandika, enjoying life pale Dubai. <laughs> Na uko kinyata <laughs> Unafanya <laughs> ma edits. Yes. Ama unaingia mahali unapiga picha, inakaa ni kama ni life yako but you didn't even eat anything yes. there. You just walked out. So, it, so you it's a lie. Yes, it's a lie. Mm -hmm. And there are many people who are living a lie to, 
pale social media. Mm -hmm. And so you, you are admiring this guy, ukifikiri, ah, this, this dude. You know, there's this girl, alikuwa mm -hmm. na there's this, uh, one point, uh, she went somewhere, akapigwa picha na gari ya bosi yake V8. Ala. Inbox kulija. Ala. Yes. Okay, so we are also very materialistic. Yes, yes, and this is happening. But now, uh, today we are talking about mm -hmm. uh, stalking uh, our exes. Mm -hmm. And I've started by saying that this, this was an important person in your life. Yes. At some point. Yes. But now, things didn't work out. Mm -hmm. And let me say this, stalking your ex, it does more harm than good. Okay. Because... When you're stalking your ex, uh, have you, you need to ask yourself a question. Mm -hmm. Have you taken time to heal? Okay. Because the moment you have, uh, you have broken this relationship, mm -hmm. there's a vacuum space that has been left empty. And so you need to take your time and heal. But you see now, if you continue stalking your ex, mm -hmm. you'll not be able to heal. Because... You, you thought game yako iko ju. Yes. But unenda kustalk. Unapata wa. Unapata amepelekwa UK. Nini? Kagi. And you're wondering. <laughs> this earth is hard. <laughs> earth is hard. <laughs> so instead of healing. Yes. Or just because most of the times. And mm -hmm. if you've ever stalked your ex, please let us know. Kulienda mm -hmm. did you Did it help you heal? Mm -hmm. Did it become worse? Ali, Ali, upgrade, ama Ali, downgrade, mm -hmm. according to you, mm -hmm. triple one, triple four, triple one, that is our SMS line, have you stalked your ex? Have you? How did it go? Because mm -hmm. you get in there, mm -hmm. because probably you missed them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That means you haven't healed. Yes. Mm -hmm. And and you know why you are missing them? Mm -hmm. Because at some point, they were important that is true. into your life. Yes. And that's why I'm saying, don't paint them as devils. Mm -hmm. When And I think it is good to be mature. Let us mature up that when, when things don't work out, let us not go out there spoiling the name of each other. Mm. No, let us mature up. It didn't work out and you, you, can, you, you can continue being friends, mm. but with boundaries. But you see, the only way you can continue uh, being friends with this person, it is when two of you are mature. Because if there is no maturity, even friendship, she becomes your enemy. He yes. becomes your enemy. Mm. Why? Because there is no maturity. But you can take time, go there, and uh, you have a, a ceremonial breakup. <laughs> you come for a coffee. Mm -hmm. Now, leo tunachana. Inaishia hapa. You see, I know some, some people will say this is not practical. Mm. But when we are mature enough, yes. it is practical. Yeah. It is doable. Mm. And I, I, I am not talking of something I have not done. Because yes. I have been left. You, oh, okay. Yes, I have been left. <laughs> really? And I and I did. Was it, it amicable? Watch to see the sana. But you see, yes. I, I called her. Uh -huh. We had a coffee, mm -hmm. and we we talked. And I told her I wish you well. And okay. she told me I wish you well. Yes. And when I was getting married, I invited her to my wedding, and she came. Oh wow. Yes. Why? Because there is maturity there was maturity and so we should have maturity because there's no way not unless ukuwe kuna vitu ulikuwa unafuata haukupata mm. haukupata and so that's why sasa now she has become a, a devil mm. she is not a devil he is not a devil yeah it's only that things didn't work out yes. and and also sometimes we 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 get into relationships with these uh, toxic expectations okay my guy, this, this dude is not an angel. Ni <laughs> yeah? So please stop coming with toxic expectations. Yes. Eh? You want this guy to take you to heaven? But that is what you expect of them. Yes. And, you know, talking about amicable, you know, breakups. Mm -hmm. We had one over the weekend, Evie. Mm -hmm. Leona, very own yes. uh, governor, Ali, decided yes. Kusema. Yes. Now, the lady also, Kasema, there was no fighting. There were no bad words thrown around. Yes. It was very, very amicable. We're going to take a very short commercial break. I can see Willie is raring to go. We are talking about stalking our exes, moving on after that. Have you ever stalked your ex? How did that go? Hmm? Triple one, triple four, triple one. That is our SMS line. We'll be right back with Willie in just a bit.
Welcome back. Welcome back to Full Circle with Mikali. We're talking about stalking your exes. And the question is, have you ever stalked your exes? And how did that go? And I'm going to talk to you about what you need to stalk before as well. So you can know what you're getting into. Um, hi, Mikali. I'm Brenda from Kirinyaga. I'm 21 years, five months pregnant. But after I met Mimba, the father changed na akakatasi yake. Little did I know, I was going to Akona mtoi, three months, na alimkata juu ya mtoi, nilishiko, alimkata juu ya mtoi, nilishiko na stress, adi sahi sina mtu, anasimama na mimi, alinidanganya. I don't know what you can say about that. Uh, I think first I would say sorry. Yes. Sorry to her. Uh, it happened, but uh, life must continue. And so it is okay to encourage yourself mm. and uh, just know that this life it has got ups and downs That's and true. so it happens so don't stay there don't remain there continue pushing on with this life because love life 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 must continue and and this is one of uh, the most dangerous thing many people will do out there that when something uh, happens to you you stop living your life mm. and the person who offended you he is continuing with his life right now wherever he is Maybe he's doing party after party. <laughs> but you, you are there. You are dying. Please, see mama and Eliana life. Absolutely. It has happened and encourage yourself. Look for some people who can walk along with you. Because there are people out there who will help you. Mm -hmm. Look for, for uh, uh, and, and, and actually I, I would recommend for her to see a counselor. So that uh, she can be counseled. So that because if she continues the, this way, mm. she might end up uh, getting into depression, yeah. of which now things will get even worse Was. and worse. And she, and so <coughs> it is okay to go and look for a counselor or look for people who can uh, work with you. Yes, I, I think th that is what I would say uh, for now. Okay, about that. Yes, thank you. Really. But, but again, I'm, I'm also too. getting uh, yes. that uh, this guy Nikitu Amezoea. Ni habit. It is a habit mm. because this is not the first mm. time he's doing it. Mm. And so, men out there, kindly, can you, you stop? Can you stop misbehaving? Muna peana mimba alafu na potea unacha mtoto wa yenyewe. Alafu na muacha unenda kwa muingine. Please stop it. It is a bad habit. It is wrong. Why are you hurting these ladies out there? Mm. Kindly, let us <coughs> let us man up and let us take responsibilities. If you are not ready to become a father, mm. a daddy, stop it. Watch a, a, watch a kabisa. Yes. Hello, Mikali. I am Pendo. Mm -hmm. I would never mm -hmm. stalk my ex. Thank you. Because if he, he is my ex, simply it's because it never was meant to be. Yes. That Thank is the you. attitude. Thank you. That is the attitude. Hakuna kitu positive about stalking. You see? Kuna ataka moja hivi. Hakuna. Kwa sababu ilisha. Sasa ni nini hiyo? You see? Yes. When you start stalking your ex, yes. le let's, let's, let's take an example. <clears throat> you have already moved on. Okay. And you have gotten another man mm -hmm. or another woman. Yes. And now you are stalking. Ah, your ex okay. and now this is where now you even start comparing okay your current and your ex and your ex mm. and you see of course when you're getting uh, or when you are starting the relationship with this ex there's something good you had seen in her there's something good you had seen in him mm. so if you continue stalking <coughs> there are some things of course your current ziko hivi aziendani na ule I mean, you start wishing that neza chukwaya who you even nipatie who you. Now, your ex, yes. alikuwa mtu outgoing. So, every weekend, mko vasha. The other weekend, <laughs> mko watamu. <laughs> the other weekend, mko machakus. <laughs> then, who you na ye mwingine, yes. amekuja. The current, mm -hmm. ni mtu wa indoors. We? Kukula githeri, movie. Githeri, <laughs> movie. Hata hakuna pizza. He. And so, when you start talking, yes. You might start thinking like, I, it's like my ex was good than this guy. Mm. And so you might start now having some evil minds. And now you start even seeing like your current is doing nothing. Yes. And of course, there are some strength that the current has and the other dude didn't have. Yes. Because, uh, of course, you see. I'm, I'm an outgoing person uh, personally mm -hmm. and uh, sometimes <coughs> uh, the outgoing people 
Sometimes wana anga mipango. <laughs> but this indo guy, they unapata ni mtu akona mipangilio. Mm. Vitu zinaenda kwa mitaratara. Yeah. That is what we say in Greek. <laughs> this guy cannot do anything yes. without planning. Okay. But the other guy, anapijua. Random. Hey, niaje, uko hapi? I'm ah, loose. Ah, tuende. Niko sawa. You see? Yes. And you see, that one can make, when you stalk, and now you see your ex, he weekend, uh, wako Dubai. <laughs> Kiberi <laughs> movie. Kiberi movie. Yes. My friend, utaanza kufikiria vingine. Mm, so it's not healthy. It is not healthy. So stop stalking them. Okay. Stop. Let them continue with their lives. Absolutely. I know sometimes people will stalk uh, because maybe uh, again, ulikuwa, wewe ulikuwa umemweka juu, mm -hmm. then amepata ame another guy sasa amemweka chini. Yes. And so you are like, yes, ona hivo. Yes. Ujue nikuwa ama himu. <laughs> Hey. Oh God, ati hi, I stalked mse ananikatia mpaka nika friend request na fake account only to find out ana post another woman. Hu 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 hu. Nilimuacha na evidence. You see you are hurting, you see you are hurting yeah. your, yourself. Yes, yourself. For nothing. Mm. And you know, a, a survey was conducted mm -hmm. and that survey showed that mm -hmm. uh 46% mm -hmm. of many people they will stalk their exes. Okay. And uh, nine percent, they will open fake accounts. So you are mukali, but you are following your ex, Najin. Yes. So ata ya juangi ni nani? And so you are following her, but that, him, but he's not aware mm. because you are using a fake account. Yes. Sasa, why should you go? To such Post an extent. And if you're also suspecting him like that, then yes. it's important to talk. Yes. No, Mwambia, this is what I think. Mm -hmm. Because it's, there's a, an easier way. You know, I'm even thinking, mm -hmm. did you really move on? No. If you have not moved on, what do you want? Swali kwenyo. If you have not moved on, it, it, it felt like you wanted me to answer you really. <laughs> no. Ni kwa hiyo. At the Hello Full Circle with Mikali Amashanti enjoying the show Nikiwa Riru way About the topic today, I stalked my ex-baby daddy only to see him post another girl. Sema pains heartbreak too in a new Mahadisai. And it's what you're saying constantly. Stop heartbreaking. You, you see, at times you say this guy is heartbreaking mm. me, but you are the one. Mm -hmm. You are the one who is looking for these heartbreaks. That is true. By stalking him. Yes. Stop it. Watcha. Watcha. Okay. And we and actually we need to look at some of the ways we uh -huh. need to break this habit. Okay. You see? Uh -huh. Can we go through them? Okay. Number one, delete everything. <laughs> Block delete kila kitu. We start with deleting. Oh, we are not blocking. Those photos. <laughs> okay. Mukiwa masaimara. Delete them because the moment you see them, there, 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 there will be some memories. Okay. Sa sito ya usiku unakaivi una unanza kuona masaimara. So delete, delete. There are those messages. Delete them. Delete messages. Those emails. Delete them. Those chats. Delete. Ngwa mna chat sana ni usiku. Delete them. Delete them. Then the next thing, block his and her number. He block. Wacha kuangalia status zake. Unaona hii weekend kwa wapi. Apana. Block his number. Okay. The other thing. Unfollow him. Unfollow him. Kila mahali. IG, Facebook, Twitter. Unfollow. Everything. Unfollow. Okay. You see. Block. You block his IG. You unblock your heart. Okay. You block his Facebook. You unblock your heart. By the moment you continue following him, you are blocking your heart. Because this is where the heartbreak is coming from. Okay. The other thing you need to know, uh -huh. every time you stalk, unatoka hapo na ka uchungu. Mm -hmm. So, when you hear, kakitu na uko nani yanakuambia, ebu enda uangalia nafanya nini. Remember the pain you had yes. last time you stalked him, okay. you stalked her. Remember okay. that pain. And ask yourself, do I want to go back to that Pain. pain. If you don't want to go back to that pain, encourage yourself and look for a pastor or a comedian and follow him. <laughs> Hi, Mwikali. My ex was called Mwikali. Huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> we ended because Nilipata alikuwa na another dude. Mm -hmm. Sahi, 
I got another queen, but Mikali and I, we are getting alone, along. Mm -hmm. Advise me how to be a good couch. couch. I'm a nini. Kevo from Macha. Coach. To, oh, and uh, how to be a good coach. Kevo from Macha. So, exwake faster it one weeks. Mwikali? <laughs> yes. So, waliachana kwa sababu mwiks alikuwa na dude mwingine. Yes. But says they have a mwingine, but here na mwix. Wako pamoja. Wana, they are getting along. Now, I want to ask uh, this dude a question. Anaitua wa macha. Anaitua na kevu wa macha. Kevu wa macha? Mm. Uh, if you realize your current, I don't know whether it is wife or girl, a, 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 girlfriend. Another queen. Anaitua queen. Another queen. Yes. If your queen right now realizes that you are still alo going along with Mwikali, mm. Ataskia aje. Okay. And if you yourself, you kevu wa macha, mm. you realize your queen is having another dude, mm -hmm. how would you feel? But they're just friends. It's just basic friends. We are oh, mature. They are they're just, just friends. friends. If it is they're just, getting along. If, he, if it is just friendship, that's okay. okay. Because I started by saying that your ex uh, does not become your enemy. What if the queen... Mm -hmm. Now, sasa kuna mwikali na queen. Yes. Queen ndio current. Yes. What if queen mm -hmm. hapendelei urafiki yako na mwikali? Now, this is where we have, we should have an open communication. Okay. You communicate. Your queen, if your queen is not comfortable, mm. then stop it. Yes. Because again, you don't want to hurt her. Mm. Because if maybe you continue, if she says, I am not comfortable, uneza pata tena umiacho kwa mata. Okay. So mwekali ya meenda mm. na kui na meenda. Mm. Then you are left there. So it is good to have <coughs> an open communication. And I want to say this. Even as I am saying that we should continue being friends with our exes. Yes. As we meet with them, we need to be very careful. Where are we meeting? Ah. Musi meet kwa gari? No. No. Musi meet kwa nyumba yake? Ama yako. Yako. <laughs> Never. Uh -huh. If you must meet... Mneza patana kanisa, it's okay. Mukahawa. Mukahawa, mneza patana, it's okay. Na siyo, you know there are some hotels with some cubicles. cubicles. Uh -uh. Not in a cubicle. Uh -uh. Yes. Because you want the whole world to be accountable to you. Okay. Okay. That the whole world you can see, there is nothing going on between me and Mwikali. Yes. We are just catching up. Okay. Nothing else. Okay. Hi. Hivo, nothing else. Hello, Mwikali. What is the point of stalking your ex anyway? That is my question. That clearly shows you haven't moved on. Mm -hmm. You are not happy with the life you have at the moment. One should man or woman up. Yes. Thank you. Ka Ilisha, Ilisha. Mm -hmm. No going back to Egypt, please. Mm -hmm. Ruth from Eldoret. Thank you, Ruth. We're very articulate. That is the way to go. Yes. Now, this is someone, mm -hmm. uh, you know, last time I was here, we were talking about loving your, yourself. Mm -hmm. This is someone who loves herself. That's true. Because y y she don't want to be hurt. Yes. And so, is it to zingine and is it tunajiletea? Tunajumiza wenye. Yes. Stop stalking your ex. Okay. I will say it back. I enjoy it. Wow! I love today's <coughs> conversation about stalking your exes on social media. My opinion on this is that I don't think there's any wisdom on stalking them. This is because it will only lead you to depression due to the attachment issues mm -hmm. and where you feel like you are entitled to control his life or even uh, try directing and redirecting your current mm -hmm. on the basis of what your ex is doing mm -hmm. or was doing. Mm -hmm. I think the wise thing to do is to just move on with your life just for your own benefit, your own sanity. It takes courage, but it is very necessary. It's very necessary. And this gives, as I said, this gives you time mm -hmm. to heal. Mm -hmm. Because, again, when you don't heal, you'll find yourself getting into another relationship. Mm. And yet, you have not yet healed. And so, one, one you'll make a big mistake. Yes. Why? Because you'll not enter into this relationship because you want to get into. But it's because, unataka kufilisha ule mwingine. That's the other thing. People move on super fast to show the other one. I ah, already am over I'm okay. you. Mm. Apana, please take your time and heal. Okay. But you see, the moment you stalk your ex 
and you realize he has moved on he's having a girlfriend and now unataka kumuonyesha hata mimi nita nita nitaingia kwa relationship and so you start entering into a relationship and yet you are not ready yeah. only now after five months again break up mwanze kuachana tena sasa ulikuwa na ex mmoja sasa wamefika wawili at the time we never stalk my ex because atani hurt tu yes hi mwikali um hi i'm mwikali leo kuna mwikali kadha ni mwikali i'm like are you guys for real i'm from nakuja na hizi leaves hi i'm mwikali from makueni i'm four months pregnant but my boyfriend stays abroad <laughs> he comes once per year i feel like um like having an abortion and moving on with my life and go back to my ex cuz my boyfriend doesn't tell me anything about his plans but he does tell his friends uh, uh maybe here now i i get there's an issue yes. with the foundation of their relationship okay because how did you how mm -hmm. did how did this uh, start because i don't see how i'll be having a relationship with you mm -hmm. i am sharing all my life with my friends yes. but i am not telling Shared, you yes. what is happening mm. and so here there is a foundational uh, problem and yes. so we, you need to have a conversation mm. and uh, if maybe this this is where now maybe you can even involve a third party maybe you can look for his best friend and ask him what is happening mm -hmm. is it okay mm. we can we can talk the three of us because mm -hmm. there is a problem there right there i see a problem okay because um I, I won't say I love you and uh, you're even carrying my baby but I'm not telling you my progress. No. You see there's a problem there. There is a problem. And so we even need to ask is this dude serious about this relationship? Yeah. Does this dude really love this girl? And these are some of the hard questions you need to ask yourself. Because if you don't ask yourself and you just continue you also hurt yourself the earlier the better yes and so as early as now kindly mm -hmm. know what is happening ask him what is happening mm -hmm. i don't know what mm -hmm. is happening mm -hmm. in your life yet your friends they mm -hmm. know everything okay you see okay. so you need to reach out to him mm -hmm. and you solve this issue because okay. that's an issue right there right. but again i hear another issue now he she want to go back to the ex yes how will this ex that is not a solution take it it is not a solution because you're already it, pregnant yes for this for dude. this other guy but and you moved on from your ex for a reason yes there was a reason why yes so things to think about a and also maybe even this ex you're saying you want to go back mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. maybe he has moved on yes so are you going there to uh -huh. break his relationship mm -hmm. and maybe for them they are driving mm -hmm. yours is it seems like it is not working but for them yes. it is driving so do you want to go back and break their relationship? Kazi kwenu. Wili mda wetu umeyoyoma. Umeyoyoma. Umeyoyoma mda wetu watu wakupate vipi? Naweza nipata pale kwa mitandao just type Wili Kinyash na utanipata. Sawa. So, yes, it is. Maswali ni mingi hapa za ma ex. Za ma ex. Eh, yeah, so um direct kwa Wili. Yes. You can come to my inbox. Yes. We will kinyash and we'll be able to uh, handle all that. Okay. So thank you very much for having me. No and and as we wind up it is okay even to have some uh, good cultures. So even as if if uh, stalking your your act is not a good culture. Yes. So stop that culture. It is a bad culture. We should have positive cultures. And with that I understand today there are some people celebrating uh couples couples day it mm -hmm. is a couples national mm -hmm. couples day mm -hmm. so to all couples out there have a lovely couples day and my and to my lovely wife yes jane yambura yes i love you very much and have a lovely <laughs> couples uh, hey. day kama wako hakuambiangi kwa television anakupenda mm. consider reconsider okay I take that back. No. I have winners courtesy of Hako Industry giving away some gift hampers. I see Fatma from Kabete. Congratulations. And Fatma, you are an ardent follower of the show. So I'm happy that you got a hamper. Your number ends at 789. Uh, Faith Mutahi from Dagoreti. Congratulations. 714 is how your number ends. Eva from Juja. Congratulations. Your number ends at 713. We have Susan watching from Kasarani. 676. Ndiyo. 
three last digits of your number and we have viona chep from kikuyu viona is also an ardent follower of the show your number ends at three zero three six so congratulations and we have naomi as well your number ends at three nine nine the question is what are the constant segments that we have on full circle throughout the week send in your answers i still have more hampers to give triple one triple four triple one that is our sms line we'll be right back after this break